I understand that MHIMS released its M Health roadmap today. Yes. What is the significance of that in the big picture of mobile health? So the, the roadmap provides a guide, a mobile strategy for uh, the healthcare uh, ecosystem. Uh, as the M Health um, ecosystem is, is evolving, uh, this, the roadmap provides a guide to both um, for profits, profits companies, as well as uh, governmental, non government organizations, uh, as well as payers, providers, uh, patients, as well. Um, it's, it's an exciting time to be involved in ML since um, it's what I compare it to the 90s and the internet is the boom. So we're kind of at that area where uh, a lot of change is occurring, um, a lot of questions are being answered, and we hope that the roadmap provides some answers to a lot of those questions. Okay. So what this will help providers, you believe? Providers, payers, um, hospitals, you know, a lot of people don't know what M Health is. They don't know what wireless medicine is, what mobility is, um, some of the barriers to adoption that, you know, the roadmap is divided into six sections. Some of them include new care models, so what are ways, um, new ways of providing care to patients. Um, in terms of legal and policy, what are some of the barriers from a legal perspective? Um, what are the return on investments and, and payment barriers and successes? Yeah. So it's a jump start. Yeah, it's a yeah. jump start. It's a good. Okay. It's a good place to start if you do not have a mobile strategy or do not know about M Health. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay.